How do you think your season's gone so far? It's been improving. Um, I haven't started in this way and how I wanted to start. I think my, expect my expectations were a bit too high and when I started to do things step by step and not trying to, to jump, you know, straight forward, uh, it started to get better and better and better slowly and I think, you know, focusing on the right stuff but not not all together at the same time. Yeah. I think your, no, I think your progression has been getting better and better race on race, which is what we're looking for, yeah. I think. I think we started further back than I was hoping for. Yeah. But the progression is there. Imola obviously was outstanding in terms of the move he did, but not just that. When I look at some of the the elements of where you were in Barcelona as well, and the fighting you're doing, it's improving. I would say yeah, the yeah. quality of racing is improving yeah. as well as the pace. So well done, that regard. The reason for having here, and the reason why we have these two chaps with us as well, is I'd like to offer you the opportunity to take FP1 in Silverstone, um, and it's a reward for. Um, really the fact that I think you are showing improvement throughout the season, that you're progressing. Um, you're going to have all the stress on your shoulders in the world, especially because you're going to have <laughs> F2 around you, um, and you're going to have to jump straight in the car, and it'll yeah. be difficult. By the way, the transition back from the F1 to the F2, you're going to struggle with it, mm. and your, your performance in the weekend will suffer. Mm. Prepare yourself mentally for it. Congratulations. Or anything else? Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. That's sir. it. You're welcome. <laughs> Good. Well done. Well done. If you are excited, imagine how much I am. It's, uh, I think, the best track ever to drive a Formula 1 car, and, and I am really excited. I did a, a lot of prep to try and be the most ready I can, uh, so let's see how it goes. So I am really looking forward to it. It's an amazing opportunity that, that Williams gave me, and uh, they have been super supportive, and to have the chance here to, to drive my first FP1, it's a dream come true, so let's see how it goes. It's great. Uh, first FP1 of my life done. Uh, it's a, an amazing moment for myself. I have enjoyed every lap of it, every corner of it, and that's I think what I'm the most happy about. Um, the first FP1, it only happens once in your life, once in your life, you know. And uh, I felt like I, I done the best I could. Um, to be honest, I felt there was much more on the table, and I couldn't maximize some corners, which uh, I've been improving during the long run. But of course, with the old tires, it's, it's tricky. Now taking some protein as I'm gonna head off to the to the quality of F2 uh, in one hour only. So uh, excited for that as well, but I'm just delighted for the opportunity that Williams gave me. Um, the support that I received from the team, it's been in another level. So uh, yeah, I am super proud of what we achieved with the people that support me and I need to keep working. I want to arrive here in a few years uh, and I think this is the way. So thank you Williams for the opportunity and let's keep pushing. See you guys.